So for today's review, we've got the Jimmy Airblown Inflatable 8 foot long from 2005 Easter egg patch. Now I ordered this off of eBay for what was going to be a little over $118. However, I contacted the seller saying, hey, look, you know, I'm an inflatable collector. I've got to save some money for the 2021s that are going to release this year. Would you maybe consider, you know, doing 90? And sure enough, a few hours later, he sent out an offer to the watchers for the listing that was a 24% discount, which was 118 down to 90. And I was the first one to accept. That's how I got this in my hands. It is an amazing inflatable brand new sealed cannot wait to open it so let's go ahead and do it now other than some fading at the front of the box especially right here and some minor wear around the edges i would say that the seller has done a pretty phenomenal job keeping this box this pristine if not perfect condition go ahead and take it out it does have the zip tie right there like the classic inflatable so i will have to undo that First of all, the inflatable is just great. Inflates very tight, actually, uh, especially right there. The outer eggs don't get as much air that's expected, but it still it inflates great for a 16-year-old inflatable. From what I can tell, it has four C7s, one in the four larger eggs, and then none in the three smaller ones. That's just what I can tell in the daytime. That might not be the case in the end. That's just what I can tell from right now the patterns that jimmy chose for the eggs are really cool i feel like if they did a different version of this like maybe next year or something the patterns would be a little bit more updated and modern but for these i really like them it definitely tells me that it's a classic just based off of the designs that they chose it looks a little bit mardi gras ish to me the only one that really stands out to me is like an easter design is the yellow dots and then the purple slash pink background there for example this color wouldn't really remind me of easter too much I, I would expect more of a pink more of a yellow more of a i don't know like more of a like a light blue there's no light blue on this inflatable and i feel like that's something that jimmy would definitely put on an egg collection or an egg patch if they made it say next year or you know anytime around this period of inflatables the modern era if you want to refer to it as that but still a really cool design all in all so it has two tethered d-rings essentially uh two on the main egg and then i would say it's about three to three and a half feet tall and then these zippers located on like the left hand side of the fan just if you were curious but yeah that's pretty much all the specifications i have for it and yeah a, a really sweet design great job by jimmy well i really hope you enjoyed my review on this jimmy eight foot long airborne inflatable easter egg patch if you did please leave a like if you're new to the channel, please consider giving me a sub and I'll catch you later. Peace out. Bye.